Preeclampsia can be deadly for a developing baby and dangerous for mom too, years afterwards. So it's not something that ends with delivery but has ongoing implications for uh, cardiovascular health. Women with high blood pressure or kidney disease before pregnancy may be at high risk for developing preeclampsia during pregnancy. The U.S. Preventative Services Task Force has recommended women at high risk take one of these daily. But actually if you take a low dose you know, baby aspirin, you can decrease the risk of developing preeclampsia because that aspirin is an anticoagulant. But is that information getting through? Researchers use data from a smartphone app called My Healthy Pregnancy to determine if pregnant women at high risk of preeclampsia were following recommendations. And what we found, uh, which was particularly interesting, was that about 37% of those patients who were prescribed aspirin um, appropriately were not aware that they were being prescribed aspirin. The study also found that of the pregnant women who knew they should take baby aspirin, less than half. Only 49% followed their doctor's advice. Krishnamurti and her colleagues say they're not sure why there's a problem with adherence. Some women may hesitate to take any medication during pregnancy, and others confuse safe drugs like baby aspirin with drugs that are not safe for pregnancy, like ibuprofen. But in a low enough dose, there are really no risks to the mother or fetus from taking it. I'm Marty Salt reporting.